2017 Holiday Rambler Vacationer 36H. So this is a luxury Class A bunkhouse. This has triple slide. Uh, it's on 22 and a half inch wheels, full body paint. Definitely a luxury motorhome. So I'll show some of the features on the outside, and then we'll check out the inside. So up front, Holiday Rambler does oversized glass, so they slope it down, so you got a really good viewing angle. With the 22 and a half inch wheels, it really has a diesel feel, nice tall motorhome, so you have just amazing visibility throughout the motorhome. Um, Holiday Rambler is also doing oversized windows throughout the coach, so this is a, just a very, very big window to be able to get really good visibility. And of course, you will have standard, the backup camera and the side view cameras as well. Um, armless awning, well, arms, but they're not in your way. And you have LED lights on the end. We did option this with the outside TV, um, but not only an outside TV, you do have speakers and a radio. A lot of times they'll just put a TV out there. Um, whereas this will have full radio and really good sound. Holiday Rambler is using all bus style baggage doors, so these are all aluminum frame. They're nice, insulated, thick. They even have struts on them, so they stay open. Just a really cool setup. And here's this is your inverter. So, um, with these RVs coming with residential fridges now, you need an inverter to power uh, the fridge while it's going down the road. Holiday Rambler actually uses a bigger, a 2000 watt, so you can also power a couple outlets inside. Again, just big, huge. Uh, baggage doors and then you're, you pass through storage all through the middle of the coach and towards the rear. Holiday Rambler would raise that up with steel so that you can get full pass through. Just a very cool design. Another big storage compartment. All right here's your bunk slide. So again big frameless windows. Put your propane tank under here. And again, even more pass-through storage. Here's uh, one of your furnace vents. So you do have um, two furnaces on here and they're all auto-ignite, which is very nice. And this is the vent for your washer and dryer. So even have a washer and dryer on here, so fully loaded. Uh, Holiday Rambler actually uses one of their diesel uh, caps from like an Endeavor or a Navigator. So just a really awesome look to it. The integrated backup camera and then just the high tail lights and you do have a hitch on there for towing. Alright, another storage compartment, your own in generators back here. Um, and here's your water system. So you do have water, uh, full coach water filtration, all your low point drains are here. Here's your dumps, so they're all up, heated, raised. Uh, you do have electrical outlets here and an outside shower. So it's a really de uh, well designed uh, compartment and then this will actually walk you through hooking up at the campsite or draining your fresh water tank or winterizing. So, nice little add on there. Here's your um, a lock actually for your fuel tank, so not a lot of motorhomes are doing. Another thing construction wise Holiday Rambler does, so this is all um, steel under here so it's just a, a superior design. We're seeing so many motorhomes that are doing basically just covered plywood uh, with rollers so they can tend to get soft over time or crack. Um, this is your main slide for your living room and, or for your couch and uh, dining table. So again just these big huge frameless windows and then this slide is actually a flush floor slide so when this slide comes out it'll come out and then it'll drop down so that just allows a bigger slide out and it can support more weight. So it's just a really good system. Even a window in the door. And then the lighted handle, it's so very nice. All right, so I'll start up front in the dash area. So, so you do have a power driver's seat. Both these seats will swivel. They're really, uh, they're still kind of a faux leather, but they really seem like they're a good quality, nice, comfortable chair. Um, over here, you do have power heated mirrors. Holiday Rambler actually puts outlets in the dash, which is really nice. So if you run your generator, you do have 110 power for both the driver and the passenger as well has two of those. Um, your leveling jacks are all down here. 
and then you have generator start up here you have your power shades um, and then this would be your backup monitor and radio um, do have even some cup holders above the doghouse here so front TV I know uh, so many are going to bunks now but this has the nice front TV um, let's see here kitchens all solid surface uh, pull out sprayer just really nice hardwood cabinets these are all ozite lines so they can um, kind of withstand a little more water and uh, dirt and they're adjustable shelves in here all right convection microwave and then a three burner cooktop this is all recessed down with covers so again just big pull out drawers here Big residential Samsung refrigerator. So, just terrific. You do have these catches, um, so the fridge doesn't open while you're going down the road. Here's a 40 inch TV in here with a fireplace. Um, this dinette's pretty cool in that it has pull out drawers underneath, but then also when you make it down, you just release these levers and then these two cushions will meet in the middle and you just drop the table down below so that's really nice we see when people are actually using the dinette as a sleeper a lot of times some of the woodwork gets damaged just from banging the table around um, this couch uh, a couple of cool things it's a trifold so it does make into a good size bed and then also it has three seat belts so you have nine seat belts overall so if you're taking a big road trip with a bunch of people you actually have the seat belts that are sufficient for it um, all overhead cabinets, six big overhead cabinets. And that's where having the flush floor slide and the extra height um, is really a benefit. It allows you to have more storage. These are all with struts so they stay up if you're adding stuff. Blu-ray player in here. All right. And again, adjustable shelves, adjustable pantry. All right nice big thick mattresses on the bunks the kids or adults have a drop down tv which is a very very cool thing to do um, you do have pull out drawers and then these doors are really cool because you can actually make a kind of a private bedroom by closing both of these doors and bath and a half i'll just show the first bath um, couple really cool things Holiday Rambler is doing. They're doing actually solid surface in the bathroom. So a lot of times people would do solid surface in the kitchen where you see it and, and, and would neglect it in the bathroom where they're doing solid surface in here. A nice big sink, porcelain toilet with the uh, water saver. Big medicine cabinet. Again, adjustable shelves throughout. And then I wanted to touch on the lighting. So Holiday Rambler is using what they call multiplex lighting. So instead of having all these switches that you have no clue what they are, um, these all light up when they're on. So if you want to turn on your water pump, it'll light up blue, or you can control individual lights. It's just a, a really nice system. All right. So in the bedroom, you have a king bed, which is terrific big storage underneath there's one of your tables and then another ladder for the top bunk over here just tons and tons of storage all full extension drawers real high quality woodwork and then this is like amazing something you hardly ever see in a motorhome so a little bit under six feet but still plenty of room all right back bathroom again solid surface you do have the water or the washer and dryer in here splendid system another big medicine cabinet another big storage shelf uh, you do have fantastic fans i believe three of them in this motorhome so they already all come with the uh, covers on them so you can leave them open if you need to and then just a nice big roomy fiberglass shower you have 84 inches of headroom in this motorhome so so height should never be a problem so again this is a 2017 
Holiday Rambler Vacationer Model 36H. It's for sale at I-94 RV. We can be reached at 1-800-340-9500. Or I'm Chris. You can call me direct. 815-985-1691. All right. Thanks for watching.